Maka's guides. <laughs> hey guys, bringing you a very unique achievement in Halo 4. This one's called Midnight Launch, and you'll need to be on at least Mission 2. So you see it's pretty unique already as I am starting my guide on the Xbox dashboard. You'll need to disconnect your Xbox if you want to do it the way I'm doing it, although you can get it online. You will need to be online around 11.55 p.m., whatever your time zone. If you want to do the offline method, just set your time uh, to 11.55 p.m. Any date is fine. Make sure to unplug your Ethernet cord or um, wireless adapter if you want to get this achievement. Otherwise, do the same thing from here on out. Just do it online at 11.55. At 11.55 or maybe 11.56 if uh, you're feeling uh, courageous, you're going to load up Halo 4. You're going to go to your campaign and you're going to select the second mission. On Legendary is fine, and uh, the mission's called Requiem, Alpha Point, Alpha Point, Rally Point, Alpha, oh gosh. Um, any difficulty, obviously Legendary is fine, you actually don't uh, encounter any enemies. You'll want to skip the cutscene at the very beginning by pressing Y, just to save on time. And you will literally run through Doesn't the like mission from here on out. And you'll get, uh, you can watch where I'm going just to kind of see where you want to go to do it as fast as possible as you do need to complete maybe about two minutes of gameplay before that clock strikes 12. And what the achievement wants you to do is it wants you to complete jumps in a warthog around midnight. So what you're going to see me do is you're going to get me, I'm going to get to the warthog section. I'm going to hop in the Warthog and line myself up for a few jumps. And uh, then I'm going to open up my guide and literally wait until the, the clock strikes midnight, 12 a.m. And as soon as that happens, I'm going to get out of the, dash the guide really quick and do a few jumps. So you're going to see me do that right now. I actually set my time to 11.54, if you guys remember. And I'm set up by 11.56. So you can literally give yourself two to three minutes if you're really fast. To get the achievement um, if you're going to be doing it offline like I did. So um, you're going to be in the Warthog now and you're going to line yourself up to go exactly where I am and uh, that's because you want to have optimal time to get this achievement. So I line myself up right here, open up my guide. You can see it's 1156. I'm going to fast forward to 1159. You see the clock strikes 12. I guide out and I gun it. You have about one minute to get a lot of air. This is how I did it and I recommend it. Um, for this achievement, I did need to do two jumps and hit a checkpoint. I don't know if that's completely necessary, but that's how you get the achievement, guys. There it pops and uh, I'll show you it. Keep in mind, if you do it the way I did it, you will not have an online timestamp. If you do it online, you'll obviously have a date and time next to it. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you did enjoy the video and I'll see you in my next one. Later.